From VOA Learning English, this is the Agriculture Report. Five pairs of U.S. and Ethiopian universities are getting $15,000 from the U.S. for research and development projects. One partnership is between the University of Maryland and Deborah Burhan University in Ethiopia. The partners will use the money to train Ethiopian women to grow crops. They will teach students in both classrooms and on farms. Their goal is to help Ethiopia fight food insecurity. Becky Ramsing is an advisor at the University of Maryland. She says she hopes the program will help women in Ethiopia who might not have any other way to get training. Ms. Ramsing says the program will first train teachers and officials at Deborah Burhan University. Then those teachers and officials will teach women useful farming skills. They will learn how to grow food and raise smaller animals in small places. Sige Mariam Bashe is an official of Deborah Burhan University. Ms. Bashe says the program aims to do more than teach farming. The larger purpose, she says, is to help women care for themselves and their families. Ms. Bashe hopes the women who are trained will then train other women. Hailu Terafe also works at Deborah Burhan. She says in some parts of the country, only men are taught how to farm. Four other American universities also received awards for the partnerships. They are Brown, Bowling Green State, Ball State, and the University of North Texas Libraries. The U.S. State Department and Department of Education gave the awards in part to strengthen the abilities of teachers and school officials in both the U.S. and Ethiopia. For VOA Learning English, I'm Alex Villarreal.